Grade seven students. Today I am going to explain the lesson nine angles. Please turn to page hundred and three. Classification of angles. Right angle. Any angle of magnitude ninety degrees is called a right angle. You can see KLM is a right angle. Acute angle. Any angle of magnitude less than ninety is called an acute angle. PQR. You can see. The value of PQR is less than ninety degrees, so we call it acute angle. Page hundred and four. Obtuse angle. Any angle of magnitude greater than ninety but less than hundred and eighty. Is called obtuse angle. You can see children A, B, C. Straight angle. Any angle of magnitude hundred and eighty degrees is called straight angle. You can see X, Y, Z. It's a straight angle. Reflex angle. Any angle of magnitude between one hundred and eighty and three hundred and sixty is called a reflex angle. You can see E F G, sir, reflex angle. What is the value of it? More than one hundred and eighty, less than three hundred and sixty degrees. children you have to draw each and every angle there are five types of angles so you have to draw all the angles and write the description page 92 Question number two, you have to do for class work. You have to write the angle A B C D E F G H and the type of angle. A. Now, when you consider A, angle A, you can see, right? It is. Less than ninety degrees. So, what type of angle it is? Acute angle. Now, if you consider H, right angle. Okay, children, please do your class work. Page ninety two. the dynamic or static nature of an angle i have drawn ab bc there are two straight lines when two straight lines intersect each other an angle is formed d is the intersection point Angle is formed at B. Right. Static nature of an angle. In the static nature of an angle, the magnitude of the angle does not change. It is constant. As example. angles between the edges of the book can you see children angles between two parts of the roof the magnitude it means the value does not change 
Now you can see the value does not change. Please read page, page 92 right. Page 93, Dynamic Nature of an Angle. In the dynamic nature of an angle, the magnitude, it means the value of the angle changes. It is not constant. Children, please observe the diagrams which they have given in the page 93. Right. In the first picture, you can see two faces of a clock. Then the angles created in between the two hands of the clock changes. These angles have the dynamic nature. Then the second picture. The angles between the two blades of pair of scissors, it changes when it is used for cutting. Now turn to page 94. Exercise 9.1, question number 1. There are two sub-questions, 1 and 2. Please do for classwork, children. 